In this short video, we show how a generic software implementation of AES can easily be broken. The target board is a Nucleo board from SD and software implementation is from Embed TLS. The setup is as follows. A regular PC is connected to both the target board and an oscilloscope. There are two probes connected to the target board. A regular probe is to trigger capturing of the events and a differential probe through a shunt resistor on the power supply line. Once the board is turned on, the software that's previously loaded on the target asks for a secret. Once the secret is entered, we close that terminal and run LabVIEW on the PC and configure the PC to communicate through the serial port to the board. LabVIEW sends 150 plain texts and receives the corresponding cipher text from board, which are encrypted by the secret. At the same time, each transaction waveform is captured by the scope and saved in a data file on the PC. Note that the blue waveform is the differential probe and the green one is the trigger. Once all the traces are captured, we use MATLAB to perform the correlation power attack or CPA on the power consumption traces. A preprocessing is first applied and a correlation is performed afterwards to recursively obtain bytes of the key one byte at a time. The script outputs each byte of the discovered secret in both hexadecimal and ASCII format. For each byte, correlation curve over the time of all the possibilities are given in the first figure as well as the divergence curve that corresponds to the correlation over the number of power traces the whole process takes less than a few minutes and the secret is now discovered.